similar setting tonight as uh, we had last night under the stars in the middle of nowhere, camped on the highway. Very interesting day to be honest, a bit of a tough one. I think the total kilometres is about 170 kilometres for the 13 hours of driving we've done. The first three hours is fruitful enough to give us 12 kilometres of travel. And the average for the day in total was 14 kilometres an hour. So that gives you an idea of how hard it was. It was a lot of scrub, a lot of rocks. The boys are running around chopping trees down relentlessly. So at the end of the day, it was a massive team effort really to get the fans here. Big rap for Raf and Ricky and Nick for scouting ahead and getting it cleared. The Lampadell monument was probably the first sort of goal that we were trying to reach, and, and we got there after lunch, after leaving at 7 a.m. It's actually a really interesting story about how he's mapped the uh, the roads across. Central Australia here at WA. Probably one of the key features for us today has been the HEMA maps that we've had on board. HEMA's been nice enough to supply us with two of the Project One units, which are the digital units. They've got specific off-road maps for each area, and this is one of them. So we've been referring to that constantly. I'd say that we've all been a little bit surprised by the amount of growth and, and the deterioration of the road, but it's been a challenge, you know, and, and the van sitting here tonight, you know, I can honestly say that we've got, you know, three vans that are in good condition. Both the off-road vans are fairly well perfect. You know, I think we've probably met the limit of the venture a couple of times. Uh, it's in good shape, structurally it's perfect. There's a couple of things that we actually already changed in the R&D process earlier on. That is the demo venture, the first one we ever built. So we sort of ironed them out already. So tomorrow's further down the road, a little bit more plain sailing. Heading west for more kilometers and uh, heading towards Shark Bay.